Hey you guys, welcome to another episode of Dinner With Us. You're in for a treat, so buckle up your seat belts, kick up your feet, and enjoy this treat. And so will my kids. We'll have ultimate nacho bell grandes tonight. And I mean extra large size. You know we have to do it big for the crazy eight. So enjoy. cut right down the middle. The sky and produce pick these out. They look nothing like they look on TV. <laughs> and other people are making them. But I love guacamole so much that I'm willing to try it on my own. And kids don't know what they don't like until they try things. So I have some that like guacamole, but I have some that's like, ugh. Mm. So cup your insides out. We're going to add our, I got the, I took the easy way out. We're going to add some pico de gallo to it. Something that's already mixed with our onions, tomatoes, a lot of our seasonings. So that we don't even have to go through a lot of that cutting, you guys. I don't want to eat the part that looks yucky. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I can mash it up. Hashtag below if you like guacamole. I love it. I usually go to Chico's or Mazalon. Those are two places we have here in Greenville. Our Mexican restaurants. Okay, and here is the pico de gallo. Already made and mixed. What a sweet dream. That's Roma tomatoes, yellow onions, jalapeno peppers, cilantro, and lime juice. And some, a little bit of sea salt. We're going to also add a little bit of lime juice to that. Give us some extra. Uh. I think some guacamoles are missing salt when you go to restaurants, though. Oh, it tastes. Oh, guys, it tastes great, you guys. Mm. Oh my gosh, and it's spicy. I'm gonna have a problem sharing this with the kids, you guys. Homemade guacamole at its best by Mama Mia. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Okay, you guys, we have our hamburger on to brown, and this is your main part of your ultimate grande nachos. Just adding in your bell pepper, give it your seasoning, with some onions too. We'll just allow this to brown, washing it and stirring it occasionally so it doesn't stick. And once it's brown, we'll be adding in our taco seasonings mix. It's an easy night for us. Most of our things are already cut for us. Woo woo woo. Quick and easy with the crazy eight mom. Okay, y'all, we have the hot diced tomatoes with Fabian Ars in there, and they are hot. So we'll put them to the side in the own bowl, and we're going to pour them on top of our nachos, probably on half of it, so we don't scare the kids off too bad. Everything we have is hot. Sauce, seasoning, and tomatoes, and the guacamole. So we love spicy and hot. The crazy eight-way. Fiesta! Now it's time to add our seasoning. I choose to use the hot and spicy. I'm sorry, you guys. I got y'all all out of focus, though. Let your seasoning get cooked down into that meat, and you will have a dream. So we'll be back with our seat. Look at those little peppers and seasonings all through there. Oh my gosh! So we'll be back with our cooked and ready meat, so we can go ahead and make our nacho bell grandes. It smells great in here, you guys. And while we wait for our cheese to get ready, nice and hot, we'll just start preparing our nacho bell grandes. Let's get it started, you guys. Mm. 
Okay, you guys, we have a full and complete two pans of Nacho Bell Grandes. Yes, this pan is for the kids. The guacamole homemade by Mama Mia. My hot pecan sauce to go on me, not Asia's, and Nakaya will be eating out of this one. So we will have a great dinner. We hope you guys have enjoyed this dinner with us. Peace. Leave some comments and suggestions down below. Don't forget and make sure that you are subscribed to The Crazy 8. And don't forget about Makai's channel also. Kids Tube Artistic. See you guys soon. Love y'all. This dinner with us is out. Thanks for watching this episode of Dinner With Us, you guys. Make sure you head over and watch the video. The ultimate largest nacho moot bang with the crazy eight. You will enjoy. Give us a big thumbs up and we love you guys.